Did you know that there is a country in Africa whose descendants are a mix of Asians and the Bantu people from East Africa? Well, if you didn't, welcome to Madagascar, home to the Malagasy people. The Malagasy people are the ethnic group native to the island of Madagascar, located off the coast of Southeast Africa. The Malagasy people are descended from a mix of Southeast Asian and East African populations, and their culture is a unique blend of African, Asian, and European influences. If you look at the makeup and physical appearance of all the countries on the African continent, you will notice that Madagascar has very unique looking people. The Malagasy people have a rich cultural heritage with a strong oral tradition that includes myths, legends, and folktales. They are known for their music, dance, and traditional crafts, such as weaving and carving. The Malagasy people also have a strong connection to the natural world and traditional beliefs that emphasize the importance of respecting and living in harmony with nature. Where did the Malagasy people come from? And how did they end up in Madagascar? The history of Madagascar and the Malagasy people is complex and multifaceted. The first humans to settle on Madagascar are believed to have arrived from Southeast Asia, possibly from the Indonesian Archipelago, around 2000 to 2500 years ago. These early settlers are known as the Austronesian people, and they likely traveled to Madagascar by boat, bringing with them knowledge of agriculture animal husbandry, and navigation. Over time, the Austronesian settlers mixed with Bantu-speaking people from East Africa who migrated to Madagascar through trade and other contacts with the African mainland around the year 900. The African immigrants brought with them their own cultural and linguistic traditions, which were blended with those of the Austronesian settlers to create the unique Malagasy culture that exists today. There are about 28 million Malagasy with about 27 million of them living in Madagascar while about 1 million are scattered around the world. The influence of colonization. Madagascar was colonized by the French in the late 19th century and the country remained a French colony until it gained independence in 1960. During this period, the French imposed their language, culture and political institutions on the Malagasy people which had lasting effects on the country's social, political, and economic development. After independence, Madagascar experienced periods of political instability and economic difficulty, which were exacerbated by a global economic downturn in the 1970s and 1980s. In the early 2000s, the country faced a new wave of foreign interest, this time from China, which began investing heavily in the country's infrastructure and natural resources. China's investments in Madagascar were initially welcomed by the Malagasy government, which saw them as a way to boost economic growth and development. However, the Chinese investments were also criticized for their environmental impact and for their potential to exacerbate corruption and inequality in the country. Today, the Malagasy people make up the vast majority of Madagascar's population and are divided into 18 different ethnic subgroups, each with their distinct language and traditions. While the Malagasy people face ongoing challenges, including poverty and environmental degradation, they remain a resilient and vibrant community with a rich cultural heritage. Fun facts about the Malagasy people. 1. Language the Malagasy language is unique to Madagascar and is spoken by nearly the entire population. It is a member of the Austronesian language family and is related to languages spoken in Southeast Asia and the Pacific Islands. 2. Traditional beliefs. Many Malagasy people practice a form of animism that emphasizes the importance of respecting and living in harmony with nature. This includes beliefs in ancestral spirits, who are believed to play an important role in daily life. 3. Music and dance. Music and dance are an important part of Malagasy culture and are used to celebrate special occasions and festivals. The most well-known traditional Malagasy instrument is the valiha, a type of tube zither that is made from bamboo. 4. Cuisine. Malagasy cuisine is a blend of African, Asian, and European influences and features a variety of unique dishes. 
Some popular Malagasy dishes include romazava, a beef stew with leafy greens and ravitoto, a dish made from mashed cassava leaves and beans. 5. Sport Football, soccer, is the most popular sport in Madagascar, and the national team has experienced some success in international competitions. The Malagasy people also have their traditional sport called morangi, which is a form of wrestling that is practiced in many parts of the country. 6. Biodiversity Madagascar is home to a unique and diverse ecosystem, with many species of plants and animals that are found nowhere else in the world. This includes lemurs, chameleons, and a variety of rare and endangered species. These are just a few of the many interesting facts about the Malagasy people and their culture. The Malagasy people have a rich and unique heritage that reflects their diverse cultural and historical influences, and they continue to inspire curiosity and interest from people around the world. Challenges faced by the Malagasy people. The Malagasy people face several challenges today, including 1. Poverty. Madagascar is one of the poorest countries in the world, and many Malavisi people struggle to meet their basic needs. Poverty is particularly prevalent in rural areas, where access to basic services such as healthcare and education is limited. 2. Environmental degradation. Madagascar is home to a unique and diverse ecosystem, but it is also threatened by deforestation, soil erosion, and other forms of environmental degradation. This has a direct impact on the livelihoods of many Malagasy people who rely on the land for their food and income. 3. Political instability. Madagascar has experienced several political crises in recent years, including coups and disputed elections. This has led to periods of instability and uncertainty, which have hurt the economy and the well-being of the Malagasy people. 4. Health challenges. Malnutrition, malaria, and other infectious diseases are common in Madagascar, particularly among children. Access to healthcare is limited, particularly in rural areas, which can make it difficult for people to access the medical care they need. 5. Education. Many Malagasy people have limited access to education, particularly in rural areas. This can limit their opportunities for economic advancement and make it difficult for them to participate fully in society. Despite these challenges, the Malagasy people remain a resilient and vibrant community with a rich cultural heritage. Efforts are underway to address these challenges and improve the well-being of the Malagasy people, including through sustainable development programs, conservation efforts, and support for education and healthcare. In conclusion, the Malagasy people have a rich and diverse culture that reflects their unique history and heritage. The Malagasy people have a strong connection to the natural world and traditional beliefs that emphasize the importance of living in harmony with nature. Overall, the Malagasy people are an important and valuable part of the global community with a rich cultural heritage and a unique perspective on the world. They have much to teach us about the importance of respecting the natural world and living in harmony with each other and their contributions to the world should be celebrated and appreciated. Thanks for watching this video. If you are a Malagasy person watching this video, tell us if we missed anything about the Malagasy people. We will like to continue this conversation in the comments. Also, if you enjoyed watching the video, do well to give it a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe to the channel and share the video with your friends.